Hi guys! Um, first of all, I would just like to say that I am shooting this video at night in my apartment, which I don't usually do. I usually shoot during the daytime. So if you hear any weird noises, it's because I'm sitting about three feet away from my hedgehog cage, and because it's nighttime, they are up and about and eating and running and making all sorts of fun noises. So if you hear any weird crunching, snuffling, scratching noises, that's what that is. Um, but anyway, I just got some Halloween goodies as well as a couple of other like surprise craft things, so I thought I would do a quick haul video, because uh, Halloween is awesome, clearly. Um, so first of all, I got a bunch of stickers, uh, and all of these stickers that I have came from Target. Target has a bunch of good stuff. Um, and their stickers are all over the store in different sections, so you just gotta keep looking. Um, but I got these in the dollar section. They're glitter stickers. They're pretty big. And I just thought these were really cute. And then in the scrapbooking section, um, I got these. These are Jolie's Boutique Halloween. It's a little hard to see through the glaring plastic, but they are skull spiders. They're kind of spooky and neat. And then I have these ones that are kind of um, Day of the Dead inspired. Lots of black and ivory with silver holographic accents. So I thought, thought those were really pretty. So that was Dollar Spot scrapbooking section. And then these, I'll have to do this. Um, cute little skeleton dudes. These were in the Halloween decoration section, um, and there were some other really great stickers over there. I just couldn't buy everything because I had to be on a budget. So those were in the Halloween section, and then these ones were in the cards, like the greeting card section, um, and these are I'm thrilled about. They have had this Hello Kitty design before the Devil and Pumpkin series. Um, and I got some of these same design stickers last year, but they were just paper stickers. Um, and I really don't have a good track record with sealing paper stickers and using them in resin. Seems like no matter what I do, I always get water spots somehow. So I got really excited because these are nice epoxy stickers. They have glitter on them. They're awesome. Um, and there's four sheets of these or that I got, so yay, yay gonna have to make a whole bunch more Halloween stuff even though uh, being that it's October already I feel like I'm running out of time for that but I'll do it um, also in the dollar section at Target I got some sprinkles mmm kind of hard to see through the container yay look at that much easier to see through the top um, so these are like candy corn colors orange yellow and white which is exactly what I have been looking for they're also really nice and small so these will be perfect for resin, and I really have been looking for these specific colors of sprinkles, and there's a ton here, and it was only a dollar. Yay! So I'll be making some stuff with those. And then, let's see, what else? Um, I also got some molds. Um, this one came from my grocery store, Meyer. It's just some cute bats. Um, they do have little eyeballs. Um, these are the kind of textured ice cube molds, but I have a bunch of these that I've used, um, and since they're flat, I'll be able to dome over them and make some really cute little bats. So those are going to be fun. And then I also got this mold, um, and this one came from Dollar Tree, and I had to have it because it's awesome. So I'm going to be making some fun stuff with this. The spider webs probably would be something that I would have to paint. I don't know that I could do a two layer pour with those because the spider webs are pretty shallow and I think I would make a big mess. Um, but the spider ones I could definitely do um, a two or three layer pour um, to get some really cool effects with those. So those are going to be a lot of fun. Um, and then the last Halloween thing I have is not a craft thing, just something fun. 
that I thought I would share. Um, so there's these Funko uh, Halloween Hello Kitty, and I believe these actually came out last year, but I just found an online store that had them for really cheap, um, like only $4 each when their retail value is, I think, $7.99. Um, so I bought six of them, and I did get some duplicates. Um, but these are the four different designs that I got with these. Um, so I got this vampire Hello Kitty. She's pretty cute. And I got this witch Hello Kitty with her little broomstick. And then I got this mummy. And I really wanted one of the mummy ones because I think they're just really cute. And I like that orange bow. And then this is the one that I really, really wanted, so I was super excited to get it. Is the Day of the Dead. Um, and it's the pink and blue one. There were two different ones. There's one that's like red and kind of teal, kind of more traditional colors. Um, and then there's this one that's obviously more Hello Kitty. But yeah, so I have those, and the two duplicates I got were the Vampire and the Day of the Dead, so I have a set of these at work sitting on my desk, and then these ones are here decorating my apartment. They're super cute. And then I also got, non-Halloween, but craft-related, uh, my best friend sent me a package with random stuff in it, um, and she sent me a bunch of uh, like glitter and sequins in this awesome random goodie box that she sent me. Um, so there's this enormous bag of sequins. It's, it's ginormous. Um, and there's all sorts of fun ones in here. There's leaves and flowers and stars and um, hearts and there's holographic ones and yeah, I just there's so much awesome stuff in there. That was super sweet of her. Um, and then also this baggie. Let's open these goodies. Um, so there's some chunky glitters. Red, gold, silver, kind of the fuchsia, pinky purple, uh, royal blue. And then there's this um, multicolor one. Sorry, I was looking at the thing and not looking at the camera. Sorry. And then there's this bag of little heart confettis. So those will be really good. Um, and then two vials of like a finer glitter um, in kind of the periwinkle blue and this sort of rosy, kind of a dusty rose pink. There's lots of glitter there. And then this one is cellophane glitter. Big, chunky, pretty cellophane glitter. So yeah, that was all just like a complete surprise in um, a package. So I'm always happy to get glitter and all the sequins and all the different shapes are going to be really fun. Um, probably to put in resin pieces. So anyway, yep, just sharing some goodies that I've bought recently. Um, I have been working on a whole bunch of... I feel like I say this every time I make a video that, oh, I'll have things to show you soon. But I really have been working on a lot of Halloween pieces, and most of them are um, just kind of in the final stages of being domed or having bales and things put on them. So I do have a lot of stuff done. I'm working on getting everything put into my Etsy shop, and also I have opened a second store. I have opened a ca an account on Store Envy as well, and I'm getting that up and running. Um, I'll go ahead and put the link to the store Envy, along with my Etsy as well, down in the description bar. There's not really much in my store Envy right now because I just started it up. Um, but I'm going to use that as well because I know that some people prefer that to Etsy and some for, for some people it's easier to use. And I just figured I'd have more than one place that people can buy things from me because why the heck not? Anyway, um, thank you for watching. Uh, have a nice evening and hope everyone's getting really excited for Halloween. Happy October!